Welcome to the Pop Off Podcast. I'm Derek. And I'm Matt. And we're here with Wonder Mare. Wonder Mare. Wonder Mare. Wonder Mare. Wonder Mare. Wonder Mare. Yeah. Wonder Mare. So who are you guys? What what are your what are your roles in the band? Uh, my name is Logan. I'm the drummer. My name's Daniel. I play lead guitar. My name is Ashton. I play rhythm guitar and I sing. My name is Sean. I play bass. When I think of the name Wonder Mare, I'm thinking of the pool floaty with the rainbow unicorn. The it's fuck? Just <laughs> <laughs> well, I, you what know, you guys co- come in here. Well, you've got the sexy guitar. I've got the, the shirtless men. Um, You're goddamn right. We're kind of here at the end of Pride right. Month. I appreciate you guys coming out here and being so much here. fun. We're actually all, you know, coming out of the closet right now. We're all right, closeted right now, homosexuals. In front of everyone. Got to yeah, represent. We, actually, in the hotel earlier today, we were all butt-fucking each other. I was quiet. recording. They are pretty good friends. Yeah. Um, so that's what the Wonder Mare is about. Close. No, oh, oh, that's okay. like a magic card. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's got some. The Wonder Mare. No, okay. So whenever I was thinking of, well, I wasn't really thinking of band names. I was just laying on a leather futon tripping dick. And uh, I was looking up like these like weird Latin demons. And I saw this thing called a mare, which is like a little goblin that sits on your chest and like gives you nightmares and I thought that was cool as fuck and I just threw wonder on there because it sounded cool and I think like magic wonder has mare. tainted my mind because I thought of like nightmare the well, magic night- card horse it's like a flaming horse <laughs> or like a, a mare the like a of green. Uh, um, okay <laughs> I'm glad we got that cleared up and a yeah. rainbow pool floaty yeah rainbow pool floaty yeah where the fuck uh, did that come from yeah, well, you guys should look into those if I've you don't know wrong. what that is I was told we remind people of Windermere Windermere, the fucking street, uh, the, yeah, the fucking the town, the town. Speaking of, which is super cool about you guys, you're our first out of state guest. Deadass. Where are y'all from? We're from, we're from Alabama, Dothan, Alabama. Bama. Yes. Support. Roll Tide. That's what's yeah. up. Yeah, yeah, so really appreciate you guys making the drive down. It's convenient that we're getting to play together tonight. Uh, we were able to put this together, but yeah, you are the first out of towners from a different state. So really, thank you for coming in. No problem. Yeah, that is what's going on. We're playing later. This will be done after, but we're playing at the Brass Mug, and they reached out to us playing a show together, uh, just as some other bands have. So I do really appreciate that. And like, yeah, and you got you know a first out of state title. That's cool. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck so, yeah. Wondermer, how long have you guys been playing together? We've been uh, playing for like. Like a year and a half. Year and a half. But mm-hmm. me and Daniel have been playing just music together randomly for quite a few years. Ever since freshman year of high school, pretty yeah, much. Freshman year of high yeah, school. Yeah, we've been pretty good friends ever since then. Just yeah. don't count me. I've been in the band for a week. This yeah, motherfucker, a week. This motherfucker <laughs> yeah. joined a week ago. <laughs> yeah. I'm clutching up, man. Yeah, it's a new recruit. You know, we appreciate it. Mm-hmm. He's filling in, dude. He's doing a great job. We're so proud of Sean. It adds the diversity yeah. to look, though, because, like, you guys, like, seem really heavy when you're performing. And, yeah, like, yeah. obviously, he's a little new, you know. He's kind of <laughs> just trying to play good. And he sounded great. But uh, I love the Sublime shirt and just, like, happy okay. vibe. He's yeah, yeah, like, you're cool. Yeah. 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 This is the breeze, man. Bass player is cool always chill. Yeah. yeah. Fucking super heavy music. And this is just chilling. It's a vibe. I'm like, fuck yeah. Um, this guy rocks out. I'm sitting there with just uh, bad fish in my head 24-7. <laughs> <laughs> No thoughts, just bad fish, dude. Yep. <laughs> Plus the rush shirt, like I can tell y'all are, you know, men of culture. Very diverse rock and sense of music. I've never yeah. listened to rush. We're like a man at work right now, dude. dude. <laughs> Simulation of different sounds. <laughs> so is that how you guys kind of came up with your sound and feel? Like you guys all have, you know, different sources that you're pulling your inspiration from? Like who's exactly. writing most of the music? Me and Ashton write most of the music, but Logan writes all of his drum parts. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. I usually write a lot of the drop D stuff. Like Marvin that we just played, I wrote yeah. that, and then Ashton writes a lot of the E standard stuff, and then that's kind of that's kind of how it goes. Yeah. I just write, but we have some inter- interchanging. Yeah. It's cool that you can be there to back up on vocals too, in, in those tracks as well. I do my best. Yeah, dude. He at first it was a little I- iffy with him trying to do backing <laughs> vocals, but he's really he's really it come was to bad. it. Yeah. No, it was it more was than iffy. Awful. I it was sounded pain. like, dude. I sounded like a fucking. I don't even know, dude. Like a cricket. Dude, I couldn't even fucking listen to it. I had to just turn down the fucking amp every time he started singing. Uh, yeah, I basically had to sing without a mic, too, because, like, we didn't have, like, enough money to buy, like, a second mic. So I just sat there just screaming into the air, like, into the open abyss. Why do you? Hey, you got to do what makes it work, man. So that's the... Uh, 
That's the, it's cool that you guys were persistent with it. It sounded good. I think it was very cool that you guys had two vocalists. Uh, we play with like a, or we've had a lot of different groups on. They like the more singers they have, like that's the hack. If you want to play for long periods of time, don't just have one person do all the singing. You know. Like, exactly. Yeah, makes sense. We all got to do a little singing, man. We all got to sing a song, man. You know what I'm saying? They just no. gotta give me a mic next. It's a tough skill to like play and oh, sing cool. and, and still make it groove. Huh? That's going to take a while. But well, it takes uh, a while. something I thought was interesting, too, is you guys have mentioned in your time playing that you do travel a lot. It's exactly. Because of like in Alabama, it's uh, and like most places now, the most popular music for crowd is like rap and techno, the, the club music. Ooh. So playing rock and roll or grunge or metal, you guys have had to make some trips. Uh, anything cool with that? Like, how do you get around? I know, I know some people have like a sick tour bus. Oh, and they'll stock that thing full up, and then they'll just roll together as a unit. Like as you can tell, they spend a lot of time together. A lot of time together. So not not really me. And I in, drive instead of a sick tour bus, you, you know, instead of something really nice, we have this like 2010 Honda Odyssey, <laughs> that with like a hitch. You're welcome. Yeah, You're welcome. Logan. Welcome. Logan's this 2010 man. Honda Odyssey. Mine. This little goofy goober right here. We take his Honda Odyssey. We put a trailer on that shit, and we just. How far have you gone? Is this the farthest you've ever gone here in Tampa? No, oh, no. no, no, we, no, no well, no. actually, yeah, we've been to Tampa. Like, this will be our second time in Tampa. We've been to Orlando, but we've also been up to Utah as well. Utah, Utah Colorado. Colorado. Jesus, that's a trip. Yeah, it was Arkansas. like 27 hours. Of course, a lot of Georgia shows. A lot of Georgia, really Arkansas. Surprisingly, no Alabama shows because <laughs> our own state doesn't like us. We're not, Wait, you no, know. You, you, you played one. I, yeah, there's I did play one. The dance club. What what happened, you know, once we came back from Utah, we actually converted to Mormonism, and we now believe in the Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. We're actually all devout Christians now. And we uh, only soak. And we do not do any illicit drugs. We only I soak. Some of those churches lines. have sick sound setups, man. You probably rock that place out. Dude, dude I would fuck get up yourself playing. We need to go lives. incognito, dude. We need to, like, splinter, age, or splinter cell that shit and just, like, sneak in there and play, <laughs> play a set at a church. Let's go in mass, man. That shit would catch on fire. What about somebody gets like a banjo? It's like some country. You do everything you just did, mm -hmm. but then with a banjo. Dude, I want a Deering five string banjo so fucking bad. See? I want exactly. one so goddamn bad. Cover so Android cool. with a banjo. Fuck no. I want to make <laughs> a dude, I'm going to write some cool shit with it, though. Get one of those like cigar box. Just, just, just put it together. Speaking of, I like, I like your vibe. I like your outfit. And I like your hair, man. You got nice hair. I appreciate it. You know that. what you have? You have some beautiful golden curls there, bro. You got some there, beautiful <laughs> fucking hair, dude. Look at your hair. Oh, my God. It helps when you're rocking and rolling. You got some great fucking locks, man. I can man. tell on the video that you, you, you're you a versed rocker because of the head banging. The you head know? banging. That's you know, the signature. This is my first band. I'm not a versed rocker. I just practice a lot. That's the key. Yes. Well, there's something to get out and play, and I mean, like, it, it, it's fun to get out in, in front of a live crowd and, like, do your thing and share your sound with you people. Get a little bit more length on it. You'll see. This is everybody's first band. I am a surgeon. Band. <laughs> I am, am a, a surgeon. surgeon. <laughs> Sturgeon. Well. I am a fish. I mean, um, So you guys got an album out? We actually do have an album out. We have an album out on Spotify. It's on Spotify. It's on Apple Music. It's on everything, it's dude. On YouTube, YouTube, Napster. YouTube, Napster. It's, on, like it's on Napster, Napster. man. You it's on X, the everything app. No SoundCloud, though. No, no SoundCloud. SoundCloud. Fuck SoundCloud. SoundCloud. Fuck SoundCloud. Yeah, yeah. We're not SoundCloud rappers. SoundCloud is shit. Hell yeah. All right, well, before we wrap up, do you guys want to add anything in that isn't music related? Uh, wrap it before you tap it. Sound advice. Uh, Sound advice. Backshot's never heard of friendship. You know what I've never heard of before? What? I don't know. Dude, I'm just saying during this entire interview, I've been watching how it's made. They're making yeah, right. <laughs> they're making lemongrass. Some what is that? This is how it's made. When you when you come here, you get to see how it's made as well as get Dude. on to show you see how it's made here. Read James so. O'Barr's The Crow. Do it. Buy my OnlyFans. It's a great graphic. Listen novel. to Rush. Look at these guys. There you go. Do you listen to um, The Offspring? Do you Support know two local bands? <laughs> Support big, local bands. Support local bands. If you don't support, support local, local music, bands. I will fucking find Check you. Check these guys out. They're going to drive to your city. Send, send them a sick show. Somebody that sees this. Make them drive way the hell out there. Dude, dude, play in, where the fuck are my homies in Uganda, dude? Where are my homies in Uganda, dude? Send us out there, man. We'll go on there like a fucking mission.